Listen, I want to talk to you about how you can scale up your personal stairway to success, your personal stairway to success. And I say that because even if we all have the same definition for success, nobody has the same version of success because what you want to accomplish in life and what it's going to take for you to accomplish it is totally different than what somebody else wants to accomplish and what it's going to take for them to accomplish it. Even the word success means the fulfillment or the expected outcome of what you set out to do. So what Whatever area of life you want to experience success in, whether it's success in your marriage, success in your children, success in your health, your finances, success in your education, your career, success in your ministry or your business, whatever area of life that you want to experience success in, you got to begin by scaling up your personal stairway to success. Now, in order to scale up this stairway to success, you got to start by deciding what it is that you want to accomplish in your life. And if you can decide what you want to accomplish, in life, then determine what the expected outcome of that accomplishment looks like. And if you can determine that, I want you to sit that to the top of this stairway because there are no shortcuts to success. You're not going to get to that place overnight, but at least you know what the expected outcome looks like and what it is that you need to do to scale up your personal stairway to success. Now, in the process of scaling up, you always got to stay focused on what's next as opposed to what's important. And let me explain what that means because what's important is for you to have a nest egg in 20 years but what's next is for you not to spend the money you got on all these consumable goods what's important is for you to be able to take your kids through college but what's next is for you to not buy all these shoes and these clothes that these kids don't need what's important is for you to live your life healthy but what's next is for you to get up 30 minutes earlier work out and eat right every day of your life so make sure that you're focused on what's next as opposed to just what's important. Even God says in Jeremiah chapter 29 verse 11, don't miss what he says. He says, I know the thoughts, the ideas, the plans that I have for you. He says, and my thoughts, my ideas and plans are not to harm you. They're not to be detrimental to you. They're not to keep you abandoned, stuck at the bottom of this stairway to success, but they're to bless you to prosper you and to bring you to an expected outcome. So my challenge to you is for you to decide what you want to accomplish in life, what the expected outcome of that accomplishment looks like, leave it at the top of this stairway to success and allow yourself to scale up as opposed to staying down. 